why are seed oils bad? And it's like, it all comes down to biochemistry. Omega-3 fats and omega-6 fats are processed by the same set of enzymes, these desaturase enzymes that basically convert an omega-6 acid into like arachidonic acid, which is a downstream pro-inflammatory fat, or omega-3s, plant-based omega-3s, alpha-linoleic acid down to EPA and DHA, which are the anti-inflammatory omega-3s. They use the same enzymes. So we want those EPA and DHAs. And so if you're eating a chia seed, which is filled with alpha linoleic acid, you want to get it to EPA and DHA because those are going to incorporate into your cell membrane and your immune cells are going to use those to snip off and literally make anti-inflammatory molecules. But if you're loading your body with the omega-6 fats, you're blocking the enzymes that convert. Also, those enzymes have several nutrient cofactors like B vitamins, vitamin C, oh, no. zinc. You're using your nutrients. So people say like plant-based omega-3s are inferior to animal-based omega-3s. And in a sense, that's true. What needs to be in the cell membrane is EPA and DHA. But then we like lose the forest for the trees and think like, well, how do you actually make EPA and DHA? You convert it through a several step pathway that is blocked by omega-6s and it's blocked by a nutrient depleted diet. Now that I know they compete for the enzyme, maybe I'm a little bit less a fan of nuance. Maybe I'm a little bit more anti-seed oil. I just originally was like so, I just hate the dogma and the absolute statements, you know? Yeah. So that's why originally I became like the, our seed oil is actually the devil crusader, but I renounced my title. <laughs>